Hello everybody, my name is Gregory Parks, you are watching CVG TV and welcome to Conlink. Our next guest of honor, it will be his second time here at Convergence this year. Please welcome cosplayer extraordinaire, Night Mage. Hello, how are you today? Yeah, cosplay extraordinaire, like, thank you. That, that means a lot, thank you. Well, I... <laughs> I mean, like, it's it's not something to be thrown around lightly because you, I mean, I've, I've been following you on Instagram for quite a few years and you're just like nonstop, like from your three-day builds and your collaborations, you've ramped up a lot. <laughs> like you've been staying pretty busy. How are you, uh, how are you keeping going with all of this? <laughs> no, I don't know, honestly. <laughs> um, I think it's the same thing with conventions, how they just kind of came back full force. Um, I kind of felt like that too. Like right now, like I can I can build and do things and do the charity events in person and conventions and see people. Like I now just rejuvenated. Um, so that that's that's my thing. But I have to say that a lot more other opportunities have kind of come along like within the past year. So I'm not doing as many conventions, but there's so many just other opportunities and TV and movies and just, just other stuff going on. So I'm, I'm just, I'm really blessed. I'm just, just having fun with it. Of this latest crop of projects you've been involved with recently, like let's just within the last several months, what has been, uh, what have been some of your favorites? And, uh, in the past year, so many, like, I always say, like, everything I do is kind of like my favorite kid. I can't pick which my favorite kid, you know? Um, everything is, like, so special to me. Dude, I, I literally, I, I know it's cliche, and it's not a cop-out answer, but honestly, everything I do is my favorite thing to do until the next time I do something. <laughs> They're all my babies. I love them all. <laughs> What is the biggest challenge for you? What poses the biggest challenge when you're developing and building a cosplay that you haven't done before? So there is a project that um, I'm working on now. I can't really talk about it um, in DAs, but uh, it's, it's diving into a lot of stuff I have not worked with, um, but you know the people it's, it's a pretty big project um some pretty big names involved so yeah i can't really tell you too much about it but um the the production team on it is a pretty big production team it's going to be original characters um it's a whole new epic saga um it's going to cross board games uh tv shows um podcasts um i can say that it's kind of like dungeon and dragon style um, but when I, it, when I'm able to tell you who is, uh, producing it, you're just, yeah, you're, you're like, yeah, this is going to be awesome. Um, but yeah, I, there's a character that they came up with. Um, they had me in mind to portray the character, um, make the costume, oh. um, do the whole shebang, have my input on, you know, future iterations of the character. Um, so I'm really, really excited for it. But yeah, it's a lot of, uh, technical stuff with, the construction of the costume that I have not worked with before. But again, they, they, um, they had faith in me. And so I have to have faith in myself and I think it's going to be awesome. Um, hopefully I'll be able to unveil it like, uh, by the end of this year. Um, so we can launch everything by the beginning of next year. Um, but yeah, it's, you know, it's going to be so awesome. It's going to be great. It's gonna be and it also seems to tie in with what you said before about you never know who's watching you. You never know who's watching you. You never know who's picking up what you're doing. Another project, well, it's not even a project per se, but um, I just uh, was able to film an episode of this Judge Steve Harvey show. And um, that's going to be coming <laughs> up here pretty soon. I don't, it's probably going to be like episode number four or five. But um Again, that kind of goes to show you never know who's watching you, you know, being contacted by them, sending them saying, hey, you know, would you like to come on the show and do you have any gripes or anything like that? And it's going to be a super silly episode. It's all about cosplay. Um, and it, uh, 
that, oh my god it, and that's gonna be so fun that's gonna be so fun <laughs> So connected to that, it connected to this, um, if, if I may follow on this, you never know who's watching uh, thread. Uh, what advice do you have for people who are thinking of getting into cosplay or who are just starting or even people who have been in it but who are kind of struggling with it right now through their journey or through their work? What, what advice do you have for these people? I always tell people there's a million cosplayers on this earth, right? And all of them, every million one of them have some kind of creative talent. We're all creative in some kind of way. Um, I'm no better than the next cosplayer. Cosplayer is no better than the next cosplayer. We're all on the same playing field. The thing that makes us different though is our unique personalities. So people gravitate towards me. They might not gravitate towards the next person, but then they might gravitate towards the person after that. So it has nothing to do with your creativity, that, that shine on its own, but let your personality shine above everything else. That's what's gonna set you apart from everyone else is your own unique personality. So just always be yourself. Um, that's number one. Uh, number two, just don't ever think that you're limited to anything. So a lot of people I know who never got into cosplay they're like, oh, well, I really wanted to do it, but I don't think I can pull this character off. Or I don't think, you know, I have the build for this character or the skin color or whatever it is. I'm like, dude, I do Elvira, you know? I do Chun-Li. Yeah. <laughs> you know, I do Mystique. Link, I, do, I do Mystique. Like, here's the thing, man. Just always think about cosplay as just your fan art of the character. There's no wrong way to do your fan art. But I think those are the two biggest things, honestly, is... Um, never think that you're limited to anything because you're not and just be yourself so thank you again for your time uh, and taking time out of your day after a shoot no less to speak with us today um, it'll be a pleasure seeing you back at convergence again this year and yeah we're just looking forward to having you back uh, It's going to be a, such a fun week. We'll see you soon. <laughs> and thank you for joining us today. I'm Gregory Parks, and you have been watching Conflict.